All right, we're gonna pop this pump, this uh, this John Deere pump apart. I I'm gonna prop you up here so you can see what I'm doing. Uh, these set of caps around the outside. We gotta pull them off first before we can pull that back cover off because there's a cam. Uh, there's a crankshaft in there that uh, pumps all these outer pistons. So I'll show you here what we got. Pistons don't look bad. All right, <clears throat> those are the eight pistons, and what we're looking for is roughness on the ends of them pistons where they ride on the camshaft, and uh, none of them seem to be scored up. None of them be scored up on the bores here. Uh, I did number each cap and corresponded with a number on here on the housing. So now we're going to tear this back cover off. So. Uh, Hold on, I'll bring it back.
All right. That's the shaft. That offset piece in the middle. That's the cam as that goes around. The pistons stick in these bores. They stick into the, the center section and as it goes around, it pumps them pistons as they, it's a radial. The pistons stick in here from the outside and uh, this here's a check valve. Generally, these little check valves have a groove war in them and there is nothing. There's no, no signs of wear there. There's no signs of wear on this. Usually when they go bad this this area here gets messed up from pushing on them pistons so uh, yeah this pump is this pump has recently been rebuilt in fact this pump is newer than newer than the tractor a lot newer because this is a serialized pump uh, <clears throat> anytime like in a 4020 or something the pump will leak it'll drip out of here and run down over the front axle and everybody thinks well you pull this seal out but actually there's a seal here that seals back in the housing back in here behind that this seal just seals up all the little drips but if this seal in the shaft is bad that'll uh, that'll blow that outer seal out of there uh, yeah this pumps in really good shape I um, think I'm gonna pull these check valves out check them but uh, yeah even the bearings don't show any sign of any sign of wear so everything looks to be in pretty decent shape uh, all right, yeah, I'm going to get some O-rings for these pieces and recharge that accumulator, but uh, this pump just needs reassembled with some new seals, so I'll bring you back then. Thanks for watching.